Yeah, boy. Yes, guys. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Vinci Vi Plus. It's a very beautiful but hot day here in St. Vincent and the Grenadines today. Yes, it's one day after the National Holiday, National Heroes Day, which is a Saturday. And today we are on a mission to go to Spring Village down Cumberland, where they're having tourism, is having a program. So guess what? We're gonna be taking the ATVs. In the back is my wife. Yeah, she will be experiencing the ride today with us. All right, so guys, if you're new to the channel, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel. Not a beautiful day, and should be a nice outing today. All right, stay tuned. All right, my beautiful people, so guess what? It's time to roll out of this place and time to get on the action. Yes. So stay tuned for this beautiful ride as we travel to the leeward side of St. Vincent and the Grenadines and check out this beautiful show that they are having down there, tourism. And just stay tuned. It should be a mad vibe. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe.
all right my beautiful viewers and subscribers we have arrived in cumberland and this is the event that we are talking about and there is food but later on in the video i'll just check around and check everybody what they are selling so you can just come and buy so people have over here from barley they have blackfish or different blackfish meals and all kind of stuff we have people over there with fruits and local drinks so we will take a walk around when it really really started fully and then see what's going on all right don't forget to like comment share yeah, and stuff. so they have not yet quite started up there so we just make a walk down to the waterfront you know still in Cumberland right we have an entrepreneur here with some stuff that he made so he want to show you guys so go that way here so tell them what you so this is make from um love in the grass we plot and you make a design just like how the prisoners do that too also mm. and they have a um they have a store out villa so you could get big mats like for for your whole run front room mm -hmm. and um it's very important it may make the sense you paint them because they are natural right leave them natural they go, go natural all the time so you make you could plot from here to barley and then when they're done you start to make your design but this is a short a little pronounce i i i pronounce you know uh -huh. and i do this workshop right down here and i improve myself on it okay my name is wesley roy mason from Hill. so if anybody want to reach me and they want to get this my number is 533-4887 nice. easy as that nice. you know yeah man so where do it you're going by the exhibition or whatever no, i just i'm going by the yachties because okay. no one they haven't told me anything about that okay 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 yeah i'm going to go up there and support them still all right because i'm getting sealed by the yachties all right so do your thing do your thing yeah i'm glad to come on here trust me you just keep it safe all the so time. you have a number you have a number they go read you my number is 533 four eight eight seven all right so i'll put the number on the screen and whoever want to um yes reach out to you they go reach out to you definitely maybe you will get some sale man you never know yeah yeah you never I have know. plenty more home too yeah. yeah yes guys so that is it yeah. you know that is it support local every time okay let's let's take a walk down let's take a walk down by the jetty you guys see down here already i have a video from down here but what well, is calm to the guys, very calm. Yeah, so they have they're gonna play all sorts of sports. Cricket and those kind of things up there. So I think I'm gonna I'm gonna play some cricket for sure. I'm gonna play some cricket. Yeah. Love with the guys, check it out. Have some guys over the gun fishing yeah so i'm gonna go over there and check them out see see what they are gonna catch stay tuned
our viewers and subscribers, we made a stop here in Tite Bodel. Yeah, one of the other riders, I think he went inside the street to check something or the other. So in the meantime, we are here waiting. YP is riding, riding today like a boss, although she's in the back. Yeah, so we got three ATVs, two are still at home because remember it's five. And we brought one of those scrambler bikes, which is our dirt bikes. Yeah, so the event has not fully started at Cumberland, the one that we left home to attend. Not fully started as yet. So we're still gonna we're still gonna wait. So that's why we took a small ride just to kill some time. So by the time we go back, it will be in full swing. Uh, they have a lot of food on the menu, things that they are selling, like blackfish and a lot of local stuff. And they got some games to play, like cricket, coconut bat cricket. You guys, you know about those games way back when, before there was these fancy bats. It was cricket bats. So I think I'm gonna play that one of those games for sure. Yeah. So stay tuned for that. And. Watch out, God. I thought when we got to Saka that would, that would have been the last stop. <laughs> but we, went, we came a little bit further. If you notice, we are just in Richmond here. The volcano is up there. And look at that, guys. You can see the pitons in St. Lucia very, very clearly. You can see St. Lucia itself and the pitons. Such a beautiful look, guys. Such a beautiful look. Wow, nice. Guys, I'm telling you, these things are fun to ride. They are fun to ride. And it looks like up by the volcano is a very good day today for hiking also. It's not that foggy. I'm seeing a bit of fog just on top. But everywhere else look, look good to me. Yeah, yes guys. So my wife is over there, she's over there like a star. So from here we're going to go back, get the... Mr. Boyce, which who have the other ATV, and then maybe we can go back by the function in Cumberland. Maybe by now they have started. All right, so make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Guys, look at this, man. Ah, uh, this is from the volcano. Ah, uh, this is from the volcano. Look at how wide this is. This used to be just a small river where you used to come and bathe. When you come to Richmond, and look at it now. I've seen this video. Yeah, look at this guys. And this look like has, this was recent because it wasn't seen all those stones. So this look like it was recent. Wow. So all right, guys, we are back the the ball. Comes in. at the oh, park in Cumberland, the there, and the as side. you can see, the kids, the, stumps, the kids are ball playing a cricket game. Square, comes in for the second ball. Oh, wow, what a ball shot! Is beaten there. Badly beaten there. Yes, guys, taking this lovely cricket game. From the after, board, yeah. after this, Western we can go over there and check for the loss of one. some food because oh ah, my God, and he's clear Courtney Ambrose <laughs> had just destroyed the wicket there. <laughs> wicked guys, Clean wicked. ball and West Indies has now lost their second wicket in this big one. Yeah, so we're gonna go and check on the food in a while. Now experience your tourism falls under the ambit of community tourism. And it's community tourism is a cross by the ministry whereby we are trying to ensure that tourism is sustainable not only for hoteliers but for communities where livelihoods can be impacted community tourism involves persons who live within the community and so they are the ones who will be able to showcase the heritage the culture the gastronomy 
games, all the all the things that relates to our heritage and civilization. And it's all part of what so we call sustainable we remember, so remember we have, I just saw that you It is expected that our youths will be able to carry this on. So hence yeah. the involvement of our youths today. The North, 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 secondary, sorry, the North, 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 and the Chateauville Methodist School along with the Barrett Technical Institute they are all involved today because tourism is one of the few industries that is considered cross-cutting tourism can can be associated with fisheries it can be associated with so agriculture, video, it can know. be associated with... So, you know so this afternoon, we are happy to one, we'll ensure that the three that. community That's groups, starting from Bali, the Bali Tourism and Heritage Organization, yeah, led by okay. Mr. Cecil Gomez.